APC is talking about, you don't know them as much as I do. You came and joined us in APC. I am a founding member of the APC. You came and joined us. You came and joined us in the APC. You were in the APC. No. In the APC. You came and joined us. I am in the APC. I am a founding member. You came and joined us. You you came and joined us. You came to join us. You came to join us. Even in the APC. Even in the APC. Yes. I have a better standing and footing than you. Oh really? But once I was blind. Once I was blind. Now I can see. We have seen through your 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 orchestrations. We have seen through your lies. We are straight through your, 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 your deception. All lawyers have agreed to speed up petition hearing before Tinibu's inauguration on May 29th. Please, guys, watch the video and listen to what these lawyers have to say. My name is uh, Obed Ago. I represented the Action People's Party, APP, which filed petition number two, like CA slash PEPC slash 02 slash 2023. And the integrity of the petition we filed is to the extent that um, the election is marred with corrupt practices. The, the respondents in our petition, which includes uh, Bola Ahmed Tinibu and APC, the, he, he, he in person is not qualified in the first place to contest for the election. This is the integrity of our petition. And exactly what transpired in court there is just the pre-hearing session that we had today. The, Ordinarily, the procedure is such that we made application for Form TF008, and in that application, questions are asked, and we answered the questions. But basically, one of the um, questions which triggered the court this morning was the answer I gave to question number eight, which actually was asking, what would I want the tribunal or court to do? And we said, in the affirmative, let the courts ask the, petition, the respondents to concede to defeat, considering the weight of evidence against them. That is exactly what happened in court today. So it's no, not at all. We are not taking that part. However, you know that I am a lawyer. I, I have the consent of my clients, however it is. So if going forward they give me an instruction, I will take the instruction. But as of today, we are going on and we are strongly coming back on the 10th of That's May. Wednesday. That's Wednesday for the continuation of the pre-hearing session. So that means for now, we are going full hog. My name is Obed O Ago. O is initials. It stands for Okupwe. Obed Okupwe Ago, Esquire. Thank you very much. Yeah, thank you very much. We are very happy that at last uh, the sitting of the court has started with this inauguration. And uh, as you see, the court committed itself to cooperate and ensure that uh, these petitions are expeditiously dealt with. And on our part, all the lawyers for all the parties also uh, committed themselves to cooperating with the tribunal, the court, 
to make sure that uh, these matters are dealt with urgently because of uh, their national importance. So we are very happy today three uh, petitions have been dealt with and two uh, to come up tomorrow and the very important ones, the article and PDP uh, petition will be coming up tomorrow. So we'll be back here tomorrow for the continuation of the pre hearing session. Then next week, we learned that we filed an application seeking for live coverage of the proceedings. Can you react? I will talk about that tomorrow because um, our matter will come up tomorrow. By tomorrow, we'll be able to address you. Let's get to the bridge you. before we'll closing. We'll be able to address you fully on that. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh, has commenced we have started, we started on a very good note. Um, I believe you were here and had what we said in reply to the statement by the presiding uh, justice of uh, this uh, court. Maybe let me repeat myself. I said that the decision to be rendered will impact on Nigeria's electoral jurisprudence, judicialism, and constitutionalism. It's very, very important that this is, this is, this is made known. Because one way or the other, I do not think that it will be business as usual as far as Nigerian's electoral jurisprudence is concerned. And uh, we have assured the court that we will do all, all that we can to ensure that these petitions are had expeditiously because everybody is anxious, waiting for the outcome of the hearing. Nigerians are anxious. Most Nigerians are actions. I believe that they will enjoy what is going to happen here. Robust advocacy. You can be sure of that. Thank you very much. Thank you, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you.